What's that smell? Let's find out. Oh. everyone welcome back to my channel be they'll be crazy w um honestly recording these videos is certainly thirsty work <sighs> yeah yeah i said to myself i'm going to start to drink more water but this is vimto <laughs> mm -hmm. yeah exactly what i need i've got something a little different today than not what i usually do i usually do unboxings um of bags or slgs from louis vuitton um but today i want to do something a little different because although i do enjoy luxury bags and slgs primarily louis vuitton some other designer brands but i've also um got a little collection of perfume and scents so some of the latest scents or the newest scents that are available now i'm sure um that you guys will have already have some of these pieces but i want to discuss them with you now it's really tricky because how do you describe a scent on a video so i really had to do a little bit of research for this particular video to do my best to transcend that that information so that you can really sort of pick for yourselves yeah i quite like the sound of that or i quite like the sound of that so i think that i have let me just check one two three four maybe five perfumes some of which i got for christmas and um some of which i just bought for myself so whenever i'm traveling and i go through duty free i always use that as an opportunity to pick up a couple of um you know new perfumes for myself <laughs> make sure i look nice <laughs> pick up a few new perfumes for myself so i've got quite a collection now so i wanted to just to share them with you and sort of get your vibe on on um see if i've got any of your favorites maybe rather than your vibe uh, in 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 my collection so let's get started so the first perfume that i have for you today to have to share with you today is my caroline herrera and this is the good girl so let's open this up and take a look at this um now this perfume here we go you see this so apparently this is the the this is the iconic stiletto perfume that sort of connect with glamour it glistens there you see it's got a nice little glistening and sparkling daga design which is so so lovely and this is one of the things that i love about this particular perfume now it's supposed to connect your your good side with your bad side <laughs> <laughs> that's what it's supposed to do but i want to maybe talk more about the scent because i can't obviously i can't spray it <laughs> so i want to talk more about the scents so the scents are i think the top notes are berries jasmine and um i think maybe the the heart notes are tonka was it roasted tonka beans um but that's the best that the way that i'm when i looked it up that's what it, it sort of said but it's supposed to give you that very flamboyant feeling and also give you that little bit of modesty which you know reflects me a little bit so my um good girl from caroline herrera is one of my staple pieces uh perfumes that i like to have um really because i just love i just love the this the scent yeah it's me this is this is all me and i and i love it and I, I just like that evening elegance and this is what this makes you feel when you wear it now so, the other perfume that i have that i like to use sometimes and actually this is currently my my absolute favorite and um, this was a scent that i you know one of my colleagues at work was wearing this and i was like what is that that smells beautiful and she says it is the la veille belle la veille belle from Longcombe and i was just like oh i've got to get that and luckily i was uh, i was abroad so as i came through duty free i just picked up i just picked it up it was like a travel they had a travel one as well as this one and i absolutely mm, i was so so happy with it so let's take a look at the bottle 
was trying to make it nice let's take a look at the bottle so this is what the bottle looks like this one is the one what mill is this one this is the 100 mil this is 100 mil and it's absolutely lovely now this one has um like the transversal notes it's got iris it's got um pear blackberry orange blossom in the heart notes and also in the base note it's got heart of petulia so it's absolutely lovely and it gives you that distinct aroma you can't miss it you when you someone walking past wearing this it is a very very distinctive smell i suppose all of them are in a sense but this one you can't miss so i really really love this one i love the bottle it's so elegant look at it. it's got a little scarf on it and um, the design of the bottle the shape looks really gorgeous when you've got it sort of laid out on your dresser and it just makes it just makes your room look beautiful so for me this is one of my favorites and i really really love this one so for those ladies that are out there that are loving this one i'm with you it's it's, it's very fresh and like i say i, I i'm quite heavy-handed when it comes to perfumes i'm like <laughs> you know so people can smell me a mile away they'll oh yeah viv's on her way <laughs> so that is my um what is it la bella belle absolutely gorgeous so once again this is another new perfume that um came out very recently from the house of prada and i came across this when i was walking through the um um was it duty free um in the airport so once again i just thought it was there i had a little bit of a deal so i thought that i'd get this this one i think this is 19 mil um so let's open this one up so this is a very very new offering from prada i believe if i'm wrong fine and what i loved about this was the design in the bottle <laughs> look at this look at the bottle it's so nice now this one has like a floral ambery fragrance it's supposed to be really light and crisp look at the bottle look at the top it's got notes of, like I say, amber is at the heart of the note and it's got more of a, like a base musk um, in smell. And I really, now I'm not sure, I'll be honest, I was about to say I really love it. You know, I'm, I'm really not sure. Um, mm -hmm. No, no, no. I couldn't remember the smell of this, but it's, it's very fresh. It's very light, very crisp. So this would be make a nice daytime perfume, I think. So if I was going to work in the day, so I didn't overpower people with like scents like Rose de Vence from Louis Vuitton. I find that the Louvre, some of the Louis Vuitton fragrances are super duper strong. Like I put one of them on one night by accident just before I went to bed. I nearly choked I was like, <laughs> all night. It was really very disturbing. But this is the Prada. How beautiful is that? Really lovely. And what I'm really, what I like, what appeals to me is the, is the design of the bottles. They, they're all so different. They all look so, so awesome. And again, lined up in your bathroom or in your dresser. They look so nice. So depending on how you feel, you can pick the fragrance for you. So this for sure is def definitely in me. If you really love your floral fragrances, then I think Prada would be a really nice one to, to, to try. So it means I could have to go and get something from Prada now because I don't own anything from Prada. I don't think that I do. So I might have to go and buy something to complement this. <laughs> so this is the next one. Let's move on. So the next perfume, I actually, um, again, um, no, no, no. I got this one for, for, for Christmas, actually. My son got me this for Christmas because I bought him the the, the male version of, of this particular item. So this is this one. So this is the Pacaraban and this is the Fame. Uh, so it's got the, I bought him like the, 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 the robot, the man robot. Um, let me try. Get this over. So it comes in this really cute um, tin box. It's got a or a ban on the bottom, and there's always things that we can use these tin boxes for. And so this is what it looks like. So this is the or a ban Fame. It's beautifully presented, beautifully presented in this tin box. 
Um, now the the top notes of this is mango. Now the heart notes is jasmine. The bass notes is incense. So it's supposed to represent the irresistible Parisian spirit of a woman. <laughs> that sounds like me, <laughs> Parisian spirit of a woman. And I just really love this. So this comes with obviously the perfume and the lotion. I'm not really so fond of the lotions per se, but they make really nice hand lotions to carry in your bag. So that's that. But I want to focus more on this. So I'll take this out. So literally, how cute! <laughs> how cute is this? Look how look how wonderful they make these. So, like I say, this you know has sort of like a more of a fruity uh, aroma, um, like I say, mango and and jasmine and some incense. But it's supposed to provide that Parisian vibe. So just let me remind myself. I've now sprayed myself a couple of times, so you don't have to take off the lid. You just spray it from the top yeah yeah so i think maybe this could be like like a date night type of um perfume it, but just look how she just sits gold she's got a sunglasses on little female robot with her sunglasses on it sprays from right there um, look at the, uh, the her base so beautiful <laughs> super duper cute and i just <laughs> love these kind of things um, so this I got for a Christmas present from my son and I really really love it. It's absolutely beautiful and, and if, even when this runs out I, I'm still going to keep keep the bottle and maybe I'll collect them, an army of little robots. But if you can see through, you can actually see through it, you can see the liquid through through here. I think that's super cute as well so you'll be able to see when it's running out. So this is the Pakaraban Fame. Let's check out the next one. So guys, the next one will come as no surprise to you guys because I am, after all, Vivel be crazy. <laughs> so the next one will come to you as no surprise and this is my Rose de Vence. Now, this um, is an offering from Louis Vuitton and they have a, a expert perfumer, perfumer, I don't know if I'm saying that right. But um, so this is Rose Event. So I chose this one rather than the bottle. And I, I love that because it's travel. And I, if you haven't heard me said before already, I like to, I travel for work. So I travel for work. So I need to find things that are, that are useful or conducive for my um, movements around Europe. So this one, of course, is the Louis Vuitton Rose Event. So take a look at that. So this one is really um, has mainly, look at that. So this one really has rose everything. So it's got centella rose, it's, um, it's got Turkish rose, it's got um, Italian iris, Bulgarian rose essence. So it's, it's got a lot of rose features. So hence rose de vents. And if you like rose, the aroma of rose, then you're, you're laughing this would be a really nice investment now when i bought this um it was around it was i think it was just a 200 pounds louis vuitton has seen price increases since so it's very likely that it's gone up or you can of course just get the bottle you can look at these prices um but i, I like this one because of the ability to use a volumizer or the optimizer and just carry that in my bag um, and that can get through security no problems i've had this a while now and you can see i've only used one of the there's one inside and there's one little little refill bottle or little refill pouch refill bottle here so i've used um so i have two left so i'm probably going to have to get another one of these soon so one in there and and then two left so this is super lovely and that is my next offering that is my next offering. So the Louis Vuitton Rose de Vence. And so I wear this really if I'm, um, sometimes I'll do wear it to work, but I just don't go over the top with it because it's super duper strong. And, um, you know, if it's too strong, it's annoying. You know, like people will start sneezing around you and stuff like that. <laughs> and I'm saying that because it's happened to me. <laughs> so you have to go easy with the Louis Vuitton one. So it, they tend to last quite a while. So that's that one. So let's see what else that I wanted to showcase for you today. Um, I have, I'm saving the best till last, so you better stick around. So the next one will not be a new one. Where is it? 
the next one oh my god it is not a new one but it is again i got this it's the black opium why sell black opium and i got this from my son so he gave me uh, my other son my first born son so i have also a 24 year old son with my two kids so a 24 year old son and this is a, a christmas present and again this this is it so i'll just give you a good look so the notes here is pear pear accord mandarin essence vanilla orange blossom sort of like white flowers and it's also got a black coffee accord as well and there's definitely some white musk notes in it too okay so this is really really lovely now i can't remember like i say the only thing i don't the only thing about these is this it's makeup this lipstick is going to be too light for me but but these little mascaras are super useful so i quite like little box sets that you can get for christmas really really nice so let me remind myself again um and i think there's a theme running here i, you, I feel like the perfumes that i like are quite strong <sighs> wow like I, I like really quite strong aromas um, um, yeah that's what appears to be happening <laughs> but it's okay you know you can never have um, too many and like I say there's the bottle black crystal so like shiny shimmering and I love it so I, I, I am a, a big fan of YSL I love YSL bags YSL makeup um YSL skincare products but I only like them if I get them for free <laughs> I like them for free the skincare ones at least so this is the the next one YSL next one so this is my final um perfume this one I um got for Christmas I treated myself for Christmas because I saw this item and I also saw no no when i saw this item i was actually shopping for a friend of mine um and then when i saw this i thought wow i love that i, I would love to get her that but of course i'm not missing out i'm going to get this thing myself as well so this is oh it's a box this is the versace dylan blue is it dylan blue yeah it's the versace dylan blue box set look at that and this one um is is Vers versace say this is a tribute to feminine to to a tribute to femininity so this is a fragrance for women that know their sensuality it certainly sounds like me <laughs> so i'm all about femininity all about that I, I i appreciate my own femininity and women's femininity now this i got um from harvey nichols and it was 99 pounds um and so this oh, i won't show i won't actually hold it so this is the box that was a front cover so let's open this up let's see what is inside Ooh. and oh it's upside down so inside it is looks like this so you get a, a perfume 100 ml so the perfume is 100 ml you also get body lotion and shower gel 100 ml and you also get a versace clutch a versace clutch bag here so let's take it out so we can have a look so we've got the perfume out and let's take this out too so this versace has an amphora shaped bottle and apparently evokes greek mythology who doesn't love greek mythology i love greek mythology and it also has embossed the um, medusa head you see the medusa head and this oh my gosh when i said smell this because of course it's all well and good giving perfumes but it's they've got to smell nice so once again i'm mixing them all <sighs> yeah yeah i love love this is more subtle than all of the bat all of the perfumes um that i've that i've um shown you today so this one let's have, have, have a closer look have a closer look at these so this one um carries a top note of blackberry is it blackberry or black currant black currant 
so i think that i said um black currant and it's floral fruity and woody that's i think that'd be the the easiest way to describe it and it's so nice it's so fresh and i can see myself wearing this also again on an evening out um, going to dinner with friends you know just to really get that exotic greek mythology vibe going on so i thought this was super duper and again look at the bottle it's so elegant so gorgeous and again sat with the rest of your make with your sorry, makeup you with your perfumes it will just look so nice just elevate any dressing space completely so um i'll pop that down a second so this is a little clutch bag that you get for free if you get the if you get this pack this gift set and inside you have let's go back so inside we have the um shower gel so we have the shower gel and we have the lotion so you get your shower gel and your lotion and so then let's take a look at this so you also get this little bag versace little bag and um, there's a little section at the front i don't think there's anything in there so a little section at the front i'm trying to think when where i would use this you've got a nice big section in the middle oh and there's a chain oh it also comes with a chain so is there a zipper oh there's also a zippered area at the back so you can also use this with a little zippered pocket at the back so how cute is this this is not actually a bad free gift this isn't a bad free gift at all so i'm gonna actually put this on let me let me undo this and put this on because this is super cute this is a really great gift i really hope my friend that i bought this for really appreciate it <laughs> she's not like me at all we're a lot different so let me see if i can hook this on here and then hook this on it smells beautiful in here i've been spraying all these perfumes hook this on here oh. and there you have a really really cute cross body bag when you're going super casual yeah so it fits really nice cross body like that yeah cross body cute 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 bag or maybe you can use it as a, a makeup bag or you know like a like whatever you can use it for any little thing you want and i think that's really really cute i just love the gold chain it's it's like an extra gift isn't it so these are the perfumes and the recent acquisitions that I have um, in my, my perfume collection. I wouldn't have thought that I was someone that had a perfume collection. Um, I have many more actually in my bathroom, but these are the more recent ones that I've acquired because I really do think that um, the way that a woman smells is definitely connects with her, her very feminine side. So anyway, guys, I hope this is the end of the video because there's not much more I can say about it. So um, let's get them. So we have the Versace, Dylan Blue, La Vea Belle. We have the Paco Rabanne Fame. How many fingers do I have? Paco Rabanne Fame. Um, we have the Prada. I can't get the Louis Vuitton. Ah! <laughs> Let me get that let me get that one you're not you definitely need to be up here so these are the the perfumes um i've got the louis vuitton one over there and the ysl but i can only hold these ones because they're really really cute so thank you for watching my video today and i hope to see you again on the next one don't forget to subscribe bye